hi lovely people welcome back to my channel i hope you are all doing well and if you are new here welcome and thank you so much for checking on this channel today i'm making this tasty rich and flaky meat pie and i hope you like it as i always say no long talk biao ebi tiu tiu okay let's get started so i have four cups of plain flour i've added some garlic granules salt to taste and nutmeg i'm going to mix it together and then add my butter i'm using 250 grams of unsalted cold butter i've cut it in cubes to make it easier for me to mix it i'm going to use my hands to mix it to get a crumbly texture perfect texture i'm going for i'll now add skimmed semi-skimmed milk to it and then mix it in a dough form now i'm going to mold it and then cover it with clay film and keep it in the fridge for about an hour and then make my filling Now on a pan on medium heat, I've added one tablespoon of vegetable oil and then added some diced onion and garlic. I'll give it a stir for two minutes and then add my minced beef. I'll stir it till it turns brown. Now it's nicely brown. I'm going to add some curry powder, stock cube, salt to taste, chili powder, some all purpose seasoning, sweet agilis all purpose seasoning, and then black pepper. I've added some water. I will stir it and then cover it for it to cook till it's tender. Now it's nicely cooked. I'm going to add my vegetable, which is the carrot, green pepper, and then the yellow pepper with some sliced onion. I'm not going to let it cook for a long time so that it will keep the crunchiness of the vegetable. I've mixed one tablespoon of flour with water and added it to it to make the filling moist so that it will not make the filling dry now i will stir it and then let it cook for about five minutes and then it's done so it's looking nice i'll cover it now i'm now sprinkling some flour to my baking tray if you have parchment paper or baking paper you can use it to prevent the dough the, or the pie from sticking on the tray now i've gotten my dough out i'm going to cut it in smaller pieces to make it easier Now I'm going to use my rolling pin to roll it flat, but not too flat, about an inch. And then use my bowl to get the round shape. I'll then add my filling in the middle. And then close it i'm using my fingers to close it and then i'm now using my fork to get the pie 
nicely pie shape so i'm going to do that with all of the rest Now I'm done with it. It's on my tray now. I'm going to poke a hole, use my fork to poke a hole on the pie to allow air. And to prevent it from bursting in your oven. So I'm doing that. After that, I'm using uh, my yo um, egg yolk to give it the nice glazed golden color i've already preheated my oven to six gas i'm using gas i'm going to bake it for about 35 minutes and then bam my meat pie is ready looking fresh smelling amazing and looking rich darling i've transferred it on this rack to let it cool down a bit and then we enjoy i hope you try this recipe and i know you will love it thank you so much for watching don't forget to like share and hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified anytime i upload new video and subscribe if you haven't yet subscribed so we keep popping with yaminis. Till next time, peace.